You can use your Garmin walking GPS as a sat-nav. In fact, there is a model, it's called the Montana, for which you can buy a docking station, plug in to your car electrical system, and it has speakers which will give you voice control as you drive. But this particular one is an Oregon 450, so if you were using this for driving, you'd have to get your passenger to read you the instructions as you move along. Presumably you want to go to a location that uh, might be the start of a route. So here we have a route, <coughs> excuse me, it's Rosebush 10, and which is edit route and the start point. We review that where the information is stored and create a waypoint at that location. Maybe we would like to rename it, change the name to Rosebush. And save that. Now we've got a waypoint to navigate to, which is the exact start point of our walk rather than just somewhere in that town. Next we go to, <coughs> excuse me, where to, choose waypoints, and that particular one. There's the map, you can check it to make sure everything is alright, and hit the button to go. We want to actually drive to that route, so in this case we would say no rather than simulate, but for the purposes of this little demonstration I'll say yes. You'll notice there's a straight line going cross country, we'd have to fly, so we don't want to do that, so go back to where to and change route activity to automobile driving, it recalculates it, and I'm saying yes again, and now we've got the on-screen instructions in order that we can follow. We're on the demo now, so it's pretending to do the driving. I prefer this screen, it's uh, either the 1 to 50,000 or 1 to uh, 25,000 that I've got loaded. But if you're more familiar with uh, the traditional sat-nav type screen display, what you can do is change your profile. Which I missed. Here it is to automotive. And you get this type of map rather than the um, normal roadmap Oldman survey format. I'm going to stop this uh, simulation by going to where to I can find it menus are in a different uh, location on each profile. Stop navigation. And uh, my on-screen computer reflects what you get with the automotive profile. Because it's a simulation, there's no data in here. So that's all for now. And watch the next movie which will instruct you how to go from a remote location, that is one other than where you are, to another remote location. Bye for now.